As you know, tomorrow we're going to Dallas. We're going to start uh, our rallies back up now. We've had a tremendous uh, run at rallies. I don't think there's been an empty seat and since we came down on the escalator. Uh, with the First Lady, that was uh, with the future First Lady at that point. Uh, it's been an amazing thing to behold that we're going to be starting our rallies. The first one we believe will be probably, we're just starting to call up, uh, will be in Oklahoma, in Tulsa, Oklahoma. A beautiful new venue, brand new, and they're looking forward to it. They've done a great job with COVID, as you know, in the state of Oklahoma. Uh, we're going to be coming into Florida, do a big one in Florida, a big one in Texas. Uh, they're all going to be big. We're going to Arizona. We're going to North Carolina at the appropriate time. The governor is a little backward there. He's a little bit behind. And unfortunately, we're going to probably be uh, having no choice but to move the Republican convention to another location. That'll be announced shortly, but we'll have no choice. We wanted to stay in North Carolina very badly. We love it. It's a great state, state I won. Uh, many, many friends, many relatives, frankly, that live there. And uh, we'll see how it all works out, but the governor doesn't want to give an inch. And what he's lo doing is losing hundreds of millions of dollars for his state. But we'll uh, probably have no other recourse but to move it to another state. We have a lot of states that want it, Texas. Uh, Georgia, uh, Florida, we have many, many states that want it, but uh, we've given them everything we can. North Carolina is a special place, but I think we're going to probably end up giving you an announcement pretty soon.